Hello and welcome to our open house night here at A. Cole Alpha Secondary School. Tonight we're going to talk about the PHE options here at Alpha Secondary. My name is Megan Valama and I am the PHE department head here at Alpha Secondary School. For PHE 8, this course will introduce students to a wide variety of physical activity opportunities. Our focus will be on building physical literacy, participating in health and active living activities, and learning about balance in health through engaging in mental well-being and social and community health lessons. Students will also participate in field experience throughout our local community and have guest instructors visit Alpha Secondary to further student learning of alternate environment activities. Common field experiences and guest instructors may include skating, yoga, boot camp, self-defense, trail hiking, Tabata, jujitsu, cardio kickboxing, Zumba, HIT, Indigenous dance, and contemporary dance. In addition to their engagement in daily physical activity through sport and fitness lessons, students will be introduced to health units that promote healthy eating choices, teach strategies to help students avoid unsafe situations, explore mental health, and focus on healthy relationships. For PHE 9, this course is a continuation and progression of Physical and Health Education 8, with more attention given to healthy relationships and an extension on our nutrition unit. Students will have discussions about strategies to maintain their mental health and how engaging in physical activity in conjunction with healthy diet and stress management benefit their mental well-being. In addition, students are provided with further opportunities to participate in alternate activities with a week-long focus on self-defense through traditional Kung Fu. Students will be introduced to the principles of training through weight room lessons. Common field experience and guest instructor experiences will continue and may include skating, yoga, boot camp, self-defense, trail hiking, Tabata, jujitsu, cardio kickboxing, Zumba, HIT, indigenous dance, and contemporary dance. This course will continue to build on fundamental movement skills completed in the physical literacy section of PHE and further enhance health and active living through fitness-based activities and self-reflection. In PHE 10, the Physical and Health Education 10 course builds upon our PHE 9 course, enabling students to explore alternate activities yet still develop their physical literacy through the engagement in sport and fitness-based activities. PAG 10 continues its extension of health components and puts an emphasis on healthy relationships. In addition, students will have discussions about making positive, healthy living choices through active health units. In this course, students will be given the opportunity to explore additional physical activities available in their neighborhood, such as golf, and have the chance to become certified in a CPR first aid certification course led by Burnaby Firefighters. Common field experiences and guest instructor experiences will continue and may include skating, yoga, boot camp, self-defense, trail hiking, Tabata, Jiu Jitsu, cardio kickboxing, Zumba, hit, hip hop dance, and contemporary dance. Students will build on their prior experience in the weight room and use the principles of training to make a weight training routine that fits their fitness goals. Active Living 1112. We have an AM linear option and a course that happens in the regular school day. Active Living 1112 progresses from the PHE 10 
program and offers students with a chance to participate in a wider variety of sporting and recreation activities. The Senior PHE program combines aspects of the junior program with an increasing focus on lifelong recreational pursuits. In Active Living 1112, the main foci are health and well being, safely and actively participating in PHE lessons, and leadership. This course is a good choice for those who enjoy putting in a high level of participation in individual and team sports, recreational and or competitive activities and fitness activities. Field trips in this course may be extended to include bubble soccer, bowling, snowshoeing, kayaking, paddle boarding, boxing, laser tagging, and indoor or beach archery. Common field experience and guest instructor experiences will continue and may include skating, yoga, boot camp, self-defense, trail hiking, Tabata, jiu-jitsu, cardio kickboxing, and HIT. Students are provided with leadership opportunities throughout this course, such as planning and running an activity, visiting a junior PHE class to lead activities, or with approval, visit a local elementary school to run organized activities and games with elementary students. This course emphasizes healthy lifestyles and teaches students to stay active after they graduate from Alpha Secondary. Fitness and Conditioning 1112. This has an AM option that is linear and a regular option that happens within the school day. Fitness and Conditioning 1112. This course progresses from the Physical and Health Education 10 program and offers students the chance to participate in focused weight training program for the duration of the semester in a supervised and guided environment. The focus of Fitness and Conditioning 1112 is health and active living, principles of training, human anatomy and physiology, and social responsibility. This course is a good choice for students wanting to learn how to train and improve their physical fitness levels, including muscular strength and endurance, flexibility, cardiovascular endurance, speed, balance, power, and agility. Most of this course will take place in the weight room with periodic classroom sessions covering several topics that include physiology of exercise, nutrition, performance supplements, goal setting and the fit principle, and the basics of individual program design. Students will learn the basics of the different types of training equipment, weight room etiquette, training techniques, and safety in the weight room. This course will emphasize students to maintain the importance of personal fitness when they graduate from Alpha Secondary. Active Living Keep Fit 1112. This course progresses from the PHE 10 program and offers students the chance to participate in a wider variety of sport, fitness, and recreation activities. The Senior PHE program combines aspects of the Junior program with an increasing focus on lifelong recreational pursuits. This specific Senior PHE course approaches health and wellness from a holistic perspective, exploring not only the physical aspects of health, but the mental and emotional areas as well. Active Living 1112 Keep Fit includes fitness and lifelong recreational activities and explores health-related topics of specific interest to students in grade 11-12. This course aims to teach students the tools necessary to develop and maintain a healthy lifestyle into their adult years. Students will participate in a wide variety of activities off school grounds, such as Pilates, yoga, Zumba, kayaking, hiking, and more. Some common field experience and guest instructor experiences 
will continue and may include skating, yoga, boot camp, self-defense, trail hiking, Tabata, jujitsu, cardio kickboxing, Zumba, hip hop dance, and HIT. This course takes place in the weight room and will have daily opportunities to improve your cardiovascular fitness, muscular endurance, and strength in a collaborative way and an accepting environment. Outdoor Education 1112. This course involves participation in outdoor activities and explores outdoor safety and emergency preparedness. Students will explore environmental stewardship for outdoor activities and learn about the responsible use of outdoor environments. Students will participate in water-based, snow-based, and land-based activities in varied terrain and changing weather conditions. These activities may include stand-up paddleboarding, kayaking, rock climbing, hiking, snowshoeing, skiing, and camping. In addition, students will explore traditional Indigenous practices and ecological knowledge related to activities in the local environment. Important note, students will be expected to travel in groups to locations outside of school and may be dismissed at 3 p.m. from these locations. Thank you so much for joining me to see the opportunities that you can have here at Ecole Alpha Secondary School in our PHE program. I look forward to hearing from you and answering your questions.